The next guy we've got coming up, he's uh, one of Australia's most popular magicians. He's known as Phil Trust Me Cass, magician, made my hair disappear. Trust me. Why do people do that? It annoys me. We should be going the other way. What? Trust me. Trust. Some people go like that. Anyway, here he is, Phil Cass. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now, um, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I am in the need, a very strong need, of somebody good looking and intelligent. And uh, there's a couple of gentlemen right there. Do you know anybody? <laughs> Good to see you. Uh, gentleman just there with the rash, what's your name, sir? Albert. Albert. Good memory. Well done, and Albert. Um, stand up for a second, give everybody a laugh, would you, mate? How much would it cost you to replace everything you're wearing? You ever thought about that? A lot. A lot. Can you be a bit more vague for me? <laughs> Can't tell just by looking at it, can you? <laughs> That's why you've got to give things a test. Put your right hand in the air, sir. Yes, you may come up on the stage area. <laughs> Come on, come on, give me a nice hand, folks. Yeah. Come on, come on, come on. Come on. Thank you. Albert, you said? Yes, I did. Well, your parents had a sense of humour, didn't they? Hey, Albert. Yeah, right. <laughs> now, Albert, do you have a bad heart in any way, shape, or form? No, I don't. Good, I'd like you to take a seat on this electric chair. <laughs> and, uh, it's not really electric, I'm just kidding about. But before we go any further, do you have um, any money on you? Have you got a wallet? Oh, just a bit. Just a little? Yeah. Can I have a quick look? Take your time, you've got three seconds, oh. don't hurry. What have you got? There's uh, moss flying out of there, what is it? No, That's a 50, can I borrow that? No, no. You can give me 100, it'll be twice as funny. <laughs> <laughs> you got a 50? Can I have that? Can I have this? Yeah, all right. Yeah, good on you. Now, um... <laughs> No more. Take a seat there. I'll actually what? Hang on to your wallet in your right hand. Hang on to your wallet. And when I go down your arm like that, I want you to lift this one up. Ready? When I go down, you lift this one up. That's good. Okay, ready? Go. Up and down. With this. Ready? I'll get faster. That's good. Keep going. Keep going. Really fast. Go. Good. Now, Albert, you're going to do everything I tell you, otherwise you will not get your watch back. Oh, I see on the back here, two Albert. Two Albert with love from all the Broncos. <laughs> oh. Party boy, huh? All right. Take a seat, sir. Take a seat. No, well, seriously, take a seat. Good. You okay? Yes, sir. Good. You don't remember falling out of a hearse, do you? No. no. <laughs> what? It was an electric chair, that's all. Come on, seriously. Come on. Come on, take a seat. Come on. Take your seat. That's it. Now, I did say it was an electric chair, didn't I? Yes, I did. I'm just trying to give you a bit of life, that's all. That's it. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on. Come on. Now, don't make me hurt you. What would you like done to your clothes? Fire or scissors? You've got a free choice. Neither. I beg your pardon? Neither. Neither. You see, you see, Albert, you play along here, you don't get hurt. You understand? Good. Come on, take a seat there. Good. Now, like I said, don't make me hurt you. What's it going to be, fire or scissors? Fire. Fire? No, we're going to use the scissors. Ladies and gentlemen. The story you're about to see is true. The names have been changed to protect the innocent. That's it, practical joke. Yeah. 
<laughs> hey, Albert, Albert. Uh, I'm, I'm feeling really bad I did that to you now. Really bad. Good joke, but. <laughs> uh, no, I, truly, I am feeling bad. How much would it cost you just to replace the tie? Because all I got on me is 50 bucks. <laughs> you want the 50 bucks? Yes, I Well, come back up here, I'll show you something. Go come up here. There's your 50. Now, you've got to admit, this tie does look stuffed, doesn't it? Yes. It does, doesn't it? Yes, it does. Is there any doubt in your mind at all? No, I don't. No, so you wouldn't have any, any um, problem with just giving me this? No. <laughs> no? Because it's stuffed anyway, right? Money for it. <laughs> Do me a big favour. Yeah. Would you put your autograph on, uh, on the tie? Because that way, when, if you ever come to my place, you'll be able to see your tie up on the garage wall with all the rest of them I do this to. <laughs> Pick a half. That one? All right, go over to the table. Camera's over here, come around this way. That's it. And uh, here's, a, here's a pen. There you are. Sign your, uh, your name there. And take your time. I'll have the pen back, thank you. That's how I got it. Good. All right. Want a line? No. All right, now, Albert, just, just to recap, what we're going to do here is just to recap. I love it. Right. You Jewish, Albert? No, I'm not. Yep. Want to be? No. <laughs> now, Albert, let's throw that piece into the bag. There you are. All you've got to do is reach in the bag and grab it out. Your tie will be fixed. Would you like me to reach in the bag for you? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Here's a sick joke, huh? Right. There you are, Albert. It'll be fixed. <laughs> what happened to the other half? Signature's signature still there. Yeah. All right, we'll have to do the fire treatment. So um, get the piece that I got off there and throw it into the fire. Your fault, you did it. Joy. You want to see me? Albert, Albert, Albert. Come back up here. Come back up here. I want to show you something, Albert. This is Kim. Kim Hughes, my, uh, my special duck. Come over here, Albert. <laughs> Give me five. Yo, give the duck three. <laughs> <laughs> you just shook hands with the duck, Albert. But more importantly, would you have a quick look at this? Because you see, this is your signature. Have a look at that. Yes, it is. Is that your signature? Yes, it is. Are you sure about that? Yes, it is. Is there any doubt in your mind at all? No, no, no. Well, this is about as best as I can get it for you, Albert. <laughs> <laughs> no, believe it or not. Yeah, that was fellies disappeared again and God knows where, you know, same place my hair went.